best Transformers armada. Leave these kids out of our battle, Megatron, or face my wrath. Oh, you dare to threaten me, Optimus Prime? I welcome your wrath, because it pales in comparison to what I have in store for you. I intend to crush you, and that includes your little friends. <laughs> Listen up, kids. It's time to make a run for it. And that's exactly what we did. You see, the war between the Autobots and the Decepticons was just starting to heat up. And at first, we didn't want to get in the middle of it. So my friends Alexis, Carlos, and I ran for cover while the Battle of the Bots was about to begin. My name's Rad, and stick around for another episode of Transformers Armada. Why don't you take your little toys back home, Megatron? Yeah! Let the games begin! Oh no, he's hit! You okay, sir? Time to finish him off again! <laughs> <laughs> Care to surrender, my friend? <laughs> and miss all this fun? I see you still have a sense of humor. Well, Leader One will take care of that. Hey, look! He has a Minicon! You're right! And it looks like Megatron has already brainwashed him. Transform! A little added firepower! Huh? <laughs> you missed! Laugh now, but that is only a taste of my power. And when I'm good and ready, you will not know what hit you. <laughs> oh man, I can't believe how much that puny Minicon jacked up his power! Yeah, no kidding! Don't you get it? That's the reason they're all fighting to control them. <laughs> now I shall lead the Decepticons to victory, and the planet Cybertron will be all mine! <laughs> Okay, and check this out, Chief. They're clean as a whistle. Excuse me, Hotshot, but would you please quit trying to hog all the glory? What happened to Megatron? Huh? Hey, guys! Take a look over there, quick! Huh? <sighs> Megatron! Are you alright? Are you alright? Yes, I'm fine. Now go and destroy that obnoxious Optimus Prime. Yes, sir! Huh? Out of my way! Time to settle this once and for all, Megatron! Come on, give it your best shot! And we're going after them. Huh? 
Would you hurry up already? I'm trying. Ready or not, here I come! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I do love surprises. <laughs> Gotta run! Oh, man, that guy burns me up. This is taking far too long. The Earthlings have uncovered more Minicons, sir. Yes. Excellent news, Cyclonus. Oh, I knew you'd be pleased. Oh, trust me, I'm very pleased. <laughs> Come on, boys, we've got work to do. Yes, yes sir. sir. I'm sure Cyclonus reported your little discovery, which can only mean one thing. Megatron is on his way back. But what does he want with us anyway? All we did was find the Minicons. I wish I had an answer for you, but I don't. You know, this whole thing happened totally by accident. Carlos and me were just checking out this dumb old cave when I saw that glowing plate. Ah. Oh. Oh, please, Rad, be careful, okay? What is it? Oh. I don't know, but it looks radioactive to me. <laughs> Come on, Rad, let's hightail it out of here. Boy, the whole place lit up like a Christmas tree. I guess somehow when I picked up that plate, it caused the Minicons to come out of hibernation or something. Believe me, Optimus, I never would have touched it if I'd known it'd start a war. Please, don't blame yourself. We knew it was only a matter of time before someone discovered the Minicons. I suppose we were living on borrowed time, but at the very moment you picked up that plate, we received the signal in our Cybertron headquarters. Immediately, I dispatched my most elite force to where we were receiving the signal from. It was a matter of urgency that we arrived before the Minicons fell into the hands of our arch rivals, the evil Decepticons. Unfortunately, they too received the signal, and now our battle has been renewed. Well, I suppose we should introduce ourselves. My name is Alexis, and this is Carlos and Rad. I am Optimus Prime, leader of the Autobots. And our mission is simple. To destroy the Decepticons before they can capture all the Minicons. Well, if you guys need anything at all, you can count on us. Yeah, and we owe you big time, because you've saved our lives twice. And we're not afraid to get our hands dirty either. I appreciate your generosity. But this is our fight, and we must see it through ourselves. But I'm the one who kind of started this whole mess, so I'm here for you. I appreciate that. Now, allow my men to introduce themselves. My name is Red Alert. And you can call me Hotshot, because that's what I am, and I don't take any prisoners. Oh man, you guys are wicked cool, especially the way you can transform like that. Way cooler than those other dudes. So what's the deal with the Minicons? When Megatron hooked one on, it seemed he became more powerful. Precisely. The Minicons are the pawns in our battle. Whoever possesses them has the upper hand and is sure to go on to victory. When we first received the transmission that the Minicons have been revived here on Earth, our mission was to be the first to gain possession of them and avoid an all-out war. So the Decepticons want to use the Minicons to gain power, right? Isn't that what you want too? Yes, but we treat the Minicons as equals, see? Well, whatever he said, it sure looks like those little guys aren't afraid of you. To the Decepticons, they are nothing but slaves. Whoa! I think I understand him. It sounded like he was asking if you guys were just gonna use them as weapons, too. The Autobots are peaceful. And when the war is over, the Minicons shall be free. They help build our cities and our industries on Cybertron. They were built and designed to be workers, but never slaves. Let us help you. Yeah, and we'll do anything you want. What do you say? 
I told you before, this is our fight. It doesn't involve you. Like we said, it does, because we're the ones who opened up the Pandora's box that started all this. And I know we can help you beat those freaks. Not to mention, Rad's the only one around who seems to understand what the Minicons are saying. Isn't that right, you guys? Huh? Hey, Alexis, I was only guessing at what they were saying, that's all. Yeah, he was just messing with your head, Alexis. <laughs> like you woke up one day, dude, and could understand Minicon. Do you dare mock me! As a matter of fact, I seem to remember you guys practically begging me to come on your little mountain adventure. But did I want to be seen with a bunch of losers? <sighs> hey, we were just joking. We're like the Three Musketeers, girl. All for one, and one for all. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? You look confused. Yes, I suppose I am. Huh? Huh? You punched each other with your fist, and yet you found humor in it. Yeah, it's what we do here on Earth. It's kind of like a sign of friendship. All right, then count me in. Huh? Huh? Sorry, I, I just wanted to slap fists with you. Hot shot. Hmm? <laughs> you know, I could learn to like this Earth custom. I just hope they don't hurt each other. Men, all for one and one for all. <laughs> 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 Down, little boy. You're huh? never huh? gonna Come get on, what past you me. Pal. You wanna put money on that, pal? I'm open. I'm open. <laughs> hey, come back here! I intercepted that pass. So it's our ball, you creep. Hey, Fred, it's not my ball. Here, Alexis. <laughs> All right! Uh, next time, use your hands and not your face. I'm sorry. Yes! That's the third time in a row we kicked their butts! <sighs> so where were you guys when the earthquake hit, huh? Earthquake? What are you guys talking about? Hmm, that's news to me. I don't know, maybe we were sleeping or something. Don't play dumb, all right? We saw your bikes at the cave, Rad. Yep. You're right, Billy. We were at the cave, but Rad and me were just there having a little picnic. We never noticed any earthquake. Besides, <laughs> huh? if there was an earthquake, it would have been recorded at the research station, and we would have heard about it on the radio. My dad works up there, and he said that they had some pretty weird seismic readings that afternoon. Well, maybe you're right, but it's more likely they had some kind of computer glitch or something, that's all. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, man, man would, would you, you check, check out, out that, that sweet ride? ride? Yeah, it was a birthday present from my grandma on the coast. As a matter of fact, I just put it together myself this morning. That is one wick of BMX! It's the only one like it in the world. No kidding! I've been to all the BMX websites, and I've never seen a bike even close to that one! It's totally original! Hey, sorry, Fred. Huh? But uh, we gotta run. Hey, so where are you guys going? Check that skateboard. Oh, you mean this old thing? Uh, it was my dad's way back in the 80s. It's just a hunk of plastic. Hey, Carlos, you coming or what? I'm right behind you. Later, dudes. Hmm. They're up to something, and I'm gonna find out what. <laughs> yeah. ah. Those two make me so mad. So, Billy, you got some kind of plan cooked up? Of course. Only an idiot would never plan, you moron. Hey, I'm boy. calling you a moron, because that's what you are. I am totally surrounded by weirdos. Ugh. You're a basketball player. You're bad. Hmm, Alexis. Ah, in our little spat, I almost forgot about her. What's she got to do with anything? Everything. <laughs> Man, that was a close one with Billy, huh, Rad? 
Yeah, but they bought it hook, line, and sinker. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, you guys, but I hope you realize you just about blew it back there. Aw, oh, chill out, Alexis. They bought it. And besides, what are they gonna do? They could open up their big mouths and tell everyone what we know. That's what. It's supposed to be our secret, remember? Yeah, Don't yeah, sweat whatever, Alexis. Alexis. Oh, when will you guys ever learn? It's only a matter of time before we defeat those useless Autobots, and I become the supreme leader of Cybertron. And I'll be your right-hand bot. That's my job, Starscream. You want a piece of me, punk? Let's do it! You are so history! Your energy. I do not need my men fighting amongst themselves, thank you. He started it! Stop wasting your time with frivolous play fights. And when Demolisher said that he was your right hand man, I lost it, Megatron, because we all know that I'm next in line. Enough of your petty bickering! I was just. Did I not make myself clear the first time? For us to win this war, we must each supplement our power with a minicon. So far, Starscream, you have not yet captured your own. Without their power, we will be deadlocked in battle with the Autobots forever. So we must search out all Minicons. Demolisher! Yes! Please say hello to your new little partner in crime. Oh, thank you, Megatron. Thank you so much! Starscream! Huh? You know what you have to do. Capture a Minicon. And then we will be ready to destroy the Autobots once and for all. What in the world has been going on here, Fred? Where's the cave? Hey, take a look at this! Huh? This is so weird! It's like some kind of giant bulldozer came through here! Yeah, but who in the world could have done this? You're asking me? <laughs> wow, this place is totally awesome! <laughs> you sound like you've never been in a spaceship before. It looks so high-tech! Um, maybe that's because it is a spaceship, Carlos? Just ignore him. This place is wicked sweet! It's packed with computers! It's like the world's biggest candy store for geeks! Well, that's what I said, but they just made fun of me. Rad. Huh? I have something I'd like to show you. It is time. What is that? His name is Laserbeak. Laserbeak? Oh, wow, he's so cute! And he's so tiny! That is wicked! His job is to ensure your safety while we're here. Hey, does that mean you'll let us help you fight? I didn't say that. Your safety is my responsibility. Huh? The High Wire says there are more Minicons who are coming online out there. The Decepticons have been busy. So, what are we gonna do? I say it's time to do some serious damage. Mm hmm This is it! I guess so. Let's check it out, guys! I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying, but where are we going? Incredible! Whoa. It 
it was true. Minicons were coming to life all over the place, and our only hope was that the Autobots would be the first to find them. <laughs>